Alrighty, people, you know it's your girl or boy coming at you with another YouTube video after a month of me not posting. Okay, so the reason why I haven't posted anything, my lips are dry, um, is because I'm not a creative person, so I didn't know what to post. I'm sorry, I look a bit rough today. I look rough every day, but so this idea came to me uh, because I logged into my Facebook account and I haven't touched it in years. I'm talking like the last time I touched it was probably when I was in seventh grade. I'm about to be a senior. You know, it's crazy. And there was this one specific picture where I had, where I thought it looked good like back then, and looking back at it now, I look like a clown like a legit clown you know i thought what better idea than to create this video you know try to recreate um how i did my makeup for that one picture this is going to be a video of me recreating a makeup look i did when i was in middle school hmm. i'm gonna put a picture up right now yes it's pretty bad anyways i'm gonna talk to you guys about my middle school experience middle school was very awkward like looking back at the stuff i used to do the stuff i would talk about and the kind of pictures i took middle school was cringe for me okay so back then i used to have i always had pimples on my forehead and stuff and i had pimples like on my sideburn and i never knew why and i think it's because i drowned my face in foundation every single day without using primer but i'm gonna go ahead and put primer today because your girl doesn't have time to be fucking with pump uh, pimples or anything so i'm pretty sure for that picture i put on like some type of foundation so i don't have the same foundation anymore i don't even think they sell that foundation i got my nyx control not con total control in the shape natural i'm going to apply foundation with my fingers because i didn't use a brush back then beauty gurus hate me so all throughout middle school like ending of sixth year sixth grade year to like somewhere freshman year i had a boyfriend i'm not gonna use his real name we're gonna call him tim Tim was very, he, he was something, you know, he, he was a character, he was a card, man. Our relationship was very childish, I guess you can say. Of course it was, we were kids. Like, back then, like, we thought it was, like, a whole serious thing, like, I really thought he was gonna be my husband, you know. And looking back at it now, like, the things him and I used to talk about, <laughs> that was something. I mean, he wasn't a bad kid or nothing. I mean, he was pretty, he was really funny, you know? I always remember people would try to break us up and it would make me so mad. I used to get so pressed about it and stuff. Like, oh my God, why is she trying to break us up? We're together forever. We're in this for life. And he was like, really, really nice kid. So what I did for my eye makeup, I used some type of pencil or whatever. I try to do like a droopy eye look, I guess, to make my eyes look bigger because my eyes aren't that big. I don't know what brand this is. I found it. I probably shouldn't be putting it on my face, but I'm doing this for you guys, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and try to do that. It's gonna be bad. This is what I did to myself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Throw my whole account away. I remember I used to like. I used to want to have a whole bunch of friends. I would try my hardest to be friends with people and stuff because I wanted to be known. Uh, like I cared about that kind of stuff, which is pretty sad to think about it because now I don't talk to anybody, really. I have like, like three friends and then a guy I'm talking to. Yeah, I just remember wanting to be so known. Like, I was so thirsty for some friends. So, I have these e.l.f. eyeshadow duo thingies. I found these as well. They're, like, behind my TV. That's where I store, like, who knows what. I did not use any brushes or anything, so this is gonna be a little hard. 
I'm thinking about trying to do my eyebrows how I used to have it <clears throat> in middle school. If you're scared of ugly eyebrows, turn away right now. <laughs> that was a really bad time for me. Yes, that is how my eyebrows used to look. Tragic, I know. They're a lot better now, as you can see. It's pigmented. Oh, oh man. So I'm, I'm trying here, okay? It's hard when you were ugly. I'm gonna admit it, I was pretty, I was pretty damn ugly. You know, I'm not the best looking person out there right now, but like, I'm not too bad, you know? So yeah, damn, my head is squared. I remember this exact look because I was so proud of it. I was like, oh my god, this looks so cute. I wanna do makeup when I'm older. I mean, I still wanna do makeup when I'm older, but not, not this. <coughs> That fallout is lethal and there's powder in the air and shit. So like pigment got into my nose <laughs> Probably a lot of pigment got into my nose, man Girl I'm out here trying to steal your man, bro. Watch out. Well, I remember everybody being mad at uh, What I say his name was Tim Tom Tim Tom everybody always thought oh my god Tim. You're such a bad person. Why would you make her cry? So I used to feel so bad for him because everybody would be on his ass. And I was over here, you know, chilling with tears in my eyes and stuff. Like, I don't remember why I would cry all the time. Like, oh, shit. Jeffree Star who? Manny M.U.A. who? Laura Lee who? Nikki Tutorial who? Girl, it's Killer Kelp up in here. Y'all can't mess with me. This is a cry for help. I One thing I did know how to do was my mascara. Like, everything else would be messed up, but mascara would always be on point what's most cringe to me is whenever you know how I, i'd wear foundation every single day but the foundation was too orange and i remember just slapping it on there and stuff my face would be orange and then my neck would be this color it was so embarrassing man I, whenever i gave tom a hug or tim a hug what did i say his name was tim tom whenever i gave him a hug i, re I don't think he remembers but i remember I accidentally put my face on his white shirt. Like my foundation was on his shirt and stuff. I don't think he noticed. That's so embarrassing to say your makeup got into his white shirt. Like what? You owe him a new white shirt. Okay, so for the lips, I don't know what this is. I just found it around my house. I probably shouldn't be doing putting this on my face, but I'm doing it anyways, because I don't care about my life. I'm pretty sure it's not the one I used for that picture, but it's something similar. It smells like cherries. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Sorry for not like being consistent with my posting. It's just, I really just could not think of anything to post. And like my friends are giving me ideas. I appreciate that they were helping me out, but man, this is the finished product. It's not a phase, mom. It's not even that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being subscribed to me and all that. Um, you guys are awesome. I love you sorry again but i'm back on my game okay and i'll see you guys hopefully in the next three days yeah.